Hello, I'm Bradley, and welcome to my channel. First things first, if you're new here, please subscribe. You don't have to, of course, but it would really help me out in where I'm trying to get my channel to be. Okay, so today I want to talk to you about skincare, men's skincare predominantly, but of course, men and women can use this product. Why about skincare? I have an absolute passion for skincare because it has the power, just like hair, to make us feel on top of the world or really down in the dumps. And unfortunately, sometimes our skin can actually show even when we don't want it to, just how perhaps gloom we're feeling or if we're feeling a little bit unwell, even though we can try and put that smile on and try and show the rest of the world that we're actually okay, our skin says otherwise. Okay, so today I want to talk to you about a product. And hopefully you can see, I'm going to make sure on the front of the clip you can see there is a clear picture of this. I'm struggling with the lighting because it's a white packaging here. But today the product is Dragon's Blood instant lifting serum so hopefully you can see that but there will be i'll make sure there'll be a clip on the front so you can see it nice and clear so it's by balance active formula it's dragon's blood instant lift serum it's a lift in firm serum with three percent lithium express i believe plus dragon's blood which i believe is a plant by the way it's not something radical out there something crazy i believe it's a plant essence so okay so it's instant lifting and tightening and it's wrinkle smoothing now you may think looking at me thank you very much why on earth do i need a wrinkle <laughs> smoothing serum well just because an anti-aging product or a tightening or firming product is aimed at uh, holding back age or holding back the effects of aging uh, process, it doesn't necessarily mean to say that this is only use. Now, aging products and tightening and firming and lifting products are all about designing, of course, that plumpness, that health, that vitality in the skin. Now, both men and women, of course, as we age, that starts to show in our skin. Now, that's not to say that that's not to be frowned upon, part of the pun, but it's that a lot of people will embrace that, and rightfully so, and some people like to use products to make them feel more confident, make them feel more happy. There's no wrong, and there's no right. If you want to use products for aging, then absolutely, and if you don't want to, then that's absolutely fine as well. You look, we look, as we age, amazing for us because we are amazing as individuals and that's what i'm going to say on that topic okay so dragon's blood formula let's have a look at it so it's lift and firm it's 30 mils okay now i have tried this on and off i'd say for about the last two months i've not used it every single day i've used it once twice three times a week and i've gone through kind of the weeks like that to be quite honest with you Okay, let's tell you a little bit about it. Now, the reason why I've gone for this, now, believe it or not, I have got sensitive skin. And why do I pick an anti-aging product? Well, I pick an anti-aging product because, unfortunately, I'm not blessed with the most amazing health. And since about May time, I've been having a lot of problems with stomach-related issues, uh, hair fall, um, uh, stress. I've been dealing with the loss of my grandmother. Um, I've been dealing with a lot of work-related stress, a lot of health problems. And a couple of times, it's just all come to a bit of a halt. And, um, yeah, unfortunately, as much as I try and put a brave face, on my face tells me otherwise sometimes when i look in the mirror and that can be just sort of around the sallow areas around the eyes that can be the area on the forehead regions of course slight frown lines that can be you can get that at any age of course right the way from your teen years all the way up to your 80s 90s and hundreds if you're blessed to live that long of course now as we go through the aging process our skin loses that density losing that plumpness so of course products like that are really good at hopefully revitalizing this and pausing it and improving the appearance of it but for me personally, it's because of health problems and just because sometimes I look in the mirror and I don't sleep particularly very well a lot of the time and I get that sallowness. Um, my face just looks quite flat, quite jaunt. Um, and you may wonder what I mean by that, but almost like the hunt slept for a month, that type of look, like a vampire type of look. And very often I get that type of look. And I do find that products which are designed for boosting energy and uh, vitality and and kind of, kind of age resisting. Those products help me have a lot more, uh, have a lot more of a zing, I suppose, about me and help me feel a little bit more confident. So that's why I use them. So this product today, I chose this product because it's by Creatins. Okay, at the bottom here, sells at Creatins. I've got an email address on the bottom here. Now, why is that significant? Because Creatins um, have a lot of hair products, which I've really, really loved to use over the years when I was a lot, uh, quite a few years younger. I remember different products from them. They had a particular uh, denser hair range, which I absolutely loved. So as soon as I seen that from this product, I thought it's going to be a great product. I'm going to try it. 
So here, it's a balanced active formula. Dragon's Blood Instant Lifting Serum is a lightweight and long grossy serum that contains Dragon's Blood plant extract and a 3% Liftian and Express, an innovative ingredient that helps the skin look instantly lifted and tightened after each application. Skin that's lifted, tightened and firmer. Softens the look of expression lines and wrinkles, which we all have. Sometimes that's not just a part of aging. We can all have that, some people more than others. Um, suitable for all skin types, okay, usage, morning and night, apply the serum by gently smoothing it over the face and neck area. Now, caution for external use only, avoid contact with the eyes. If this occurs, rinse well and lukewarm water. If irritation occurs, discontinue use and, of course, keep out of reach of children made here in the UK, uh, in England. Okay, so we've got breakthrough ingredients. Just here, by the way, I don't know if you can see that on the lighting. I do apologise about that, but as I say, I will make sure that there is a clip here for giving my YouTube skills that aren't still amazing, but I absolutely love my channel when I bring all these products. I want to review them and shout about them, and sometimes not so great, but hey hey, let's get back to it. <laughs> so breakthrough ingredients, skin looks instantly lifted and tightened, lines, wrinkles appear reduced, firmer looking skin. So for me, that would be the expression lines across my forehead here sometimes, and that would be the sallowness around my eyes, okay, and sometimes that would just be the whole fresh, the whole zing sometimes which I'm missing from my skin. So I'm looking for that, that kind of revitalization, that energy boost in my skin. The soft frown lines, you could say, across the forehead if you want to be kind, and the sallowness around here and the darkening areas for not sleeping. And on the front here, of course, we've just got the packaging. It's quite nice. It's quite sort of a standout product. Looks more expensive than what it is. Wait for it, how much I paid for it, around the £5 mark. Yes, you'd think that it was a lot more. Okay, let's open it. So we've got the little bottle here. A little expensive looking bottle, you could say. And it's from Upper Pets. And as you can see, I'm about here on the bottle. So I haven't used loads of it, and I've had it for about two months now. But a lot, uh, a little goes a long way, as to speak. It is in a pipette. And it's here. Of course, it looks expensive, but it's it's a plastic bottle, plastic pipette. Um, again, unfortunately, there's no mention on here of that sort of thought for the environment, which always makes me feel a little bit deflated in today's world, I have to admit, because is that packaging recyclable, that type of thing? Where's the packaging come from? I like that when products mention that and have that, that confidence to be able to present that on their packaging too. As consumers, I feel it's important that we're responsible for that in this incredible world we live in. Um, so a bit disappointed on that fact, I have to say, but let's talk about the product itself. Okay, so for me, I don't know if you can see that on here because of the lighting, but this product I've used, as I say, two, three times max throughout a week. I've not used it morning and night, but what you can do is once you have used this product, and I always think it's best after a freshly cleansed skin, then take a few drops in your hand, and then literally warm in your hands, and then all over your face, of course, careful for the eye areas as well. Um, right the way down to the neck area, and always bring this upwards because that helps the application of the product. Men and women, of course, can use this as well. It dries quite quickly. Now, the effect which it gives when it says lifting, firming, tightening, okay, if you imagine, Almost that you've got like a, um, if you remember, if, you, if you've ever done crafting or when you were a child or anything like that at all, PVA Glow, this is what it reminds me of straight away. If you put that on your skin, okay, and how it dries, it's sort of, if you grab four, four areas of the PVA Glow, which you put on your skin and it dries, almost like a film, doesn't it? Like a, like a skin. Pull it tight. That's what it reminds me of. It sort of pulls tight on the skin, okay, and then when you're looking at yourself in the mirror, and you've got a straight face and it's dry, looks fine. If you start talking, if you start smiling, it seems to crease lots. Incredible. So yes, it does lift. Yes, it does firm. But it has sort of like this tightening and tautening effect, almost like if you put PVA glue on yourself and it dried, and then you've got like that effect where it's giving you like those type of lines. You can't quite see on here. In fact, you probably can. I've got it on today and it has creased my skin tenfold. And I've got like a thousand lines here. So yes, it does give you that lift, that firmness, if you're going to hold your face without expressions at all, like this. If you're going to hold your face like this, you're not going to have any expressions, any lines or anything like that at all, because of course you're not using your facial muscles. So therefore, it's going to hold it nice and taut, nice and straight. But life happens, it doesn't work that way. You want something what's going to work with you, help you feel confident, boost that kind of radiance. The men and women, we all want to look good at the end of the day. But this, I find, sort of gives you that tightening effect. And then if you move, particularly on this eye today, it's sort of like really, really creased up. Of course, when I relax, it's gone. But then if I smile, that type of thing, all under my eye, all up here. So somebody who has a little bit more um, premature skin, 
I'd say, 60s, 70s and older, this probably isn't going to be very good for you at all. Somebody in their 30s and 40s, it may be beneficial for them, but however, under the eye area, which is probably one of the the, the first areas to lose that density, that plumpness in the skin for men and women, and especially the neck area. And of course, for men, that sort of frown region uh, and forehead regions across the front here, it may give you a little bit more of a negative effect. So be a little bit careful if you are going to try this. Is it a great product? It's good in terms of if you were going to apply it, look at a camera, take a few pictures, great. Or if you were going out for the evening and going out for a nice meal with perhaps your, your partner or you're going out with mates, one thing or another, and you want that kind of boost of that kind of nice vitality about your skin, then great. But the expectation of that it's smoothing, it's tightening, it's lifting, it's giving you that kind of reversing the years back type thing, no. I often have a very sore kind of area here from shaving. Um, I have used this in the morning after shaving. It does soothe the skin, it does moisturise the skin, but the one thing which I'm a little bit baffled with, with this product, is that you can apply the product and then it's moisturised and it feels quite nice on your skin, and then as the hours go by in the day, it seems to get drier and tighter. So what I've done today, just to give you a little bit of a um, an in-depth insight, is that halfway through the day today, I, I was working from home today, I applied this, as you can see, it's it's like a, a thick sort of gel almost. I applied this halfway throughout the day, and as you rub it in, as you rub it in, it does boost that moisture in the skin, but then as it dries, it's okay. But then after a little while, it seems to get tighter and tighter on the skin, and it, in actual fact, it almost makes the skin feel drier. It almost makes the skin feel as though that it's too tight. And that sounds crazy, but it's almost like that it's gone too tight and that actually it's going counterintuitive the opposite way. And it's making your skin feel so tight and so dried out. What I've been finding myself doing today is actually um, in our in our kitchen area downstairs. And um, of course, downstairs, whatever. And in our bathroom area, we have... Um, uh, lotions and moisturizers on, on, on sort of pump, um, which we all use in the family here, in the family home. And um, several times there I found myself, like, I really like the Nivea uh, uh, sensitive one which you can use all over your body. And I found that I took a couple of pumps of that today and I've rubbed it all on my neck area because it's actually starting to get quite sore and I've used it across my face as well. And even though I've gone under my eye, I've been careful not to rub it over my eye so it goes near my eye area, but it's actually making the bottom of my lids sore here. So I know it's a plant extract, so of course you'd naturally have to be quite careful anyway. But yes, it's talking about that the product is lifting and tightening and firming, and it looks a great product, and it's by Createns. It's okay. Would I recommend it? I recommend somebody to use it to give their own judgment, to give their own opinion. Um, do I think it's a hero product? No. Um, and actually, after doing this review, I'm probably going to dispose of it because it's made my skin today look much more older than what I actually am. And one thing I actually hate I don't know if I'll be able to show this to you. I was on a pretty stressful call earlier and I was rubbing this side of my face. And I don't know if you can kind of see this, but can you see? Oh, it's damn lighting. That it's like bits of start. You can probably just and just see that here. And I absolutely hate that. And I looked. I don't know if you might be able to see. Yeah, just here, look, as you can see, it sort of starts to flake. And I haven't used tons of it either. So it's like. I've used a couple of drops of it all over, and of course it must create that like film tightening effect over the skin. And if you accidentally rub it a little bit, you're getting a bit stressed and you've rubbed your face or anything. Yeah, not pleasant, but in some essence, worth a try just in case you do like it, just in case you do try it. Because when I first used it, I thought it was absolutely brilliant. And then of course it went a couple of hours throughout the day and then it got a little bit drier and I thought, oh, it's just, it's probably something not this product and of course the more i've used it i thought that actually okay it's work, working straight away and then for an hour or so in a couple of hours it looks great but then it's not so great so give it a try i do recommend it at the end of the day it's only about the five pounds mark but i do realize for that you could get a really great product from the nivea men's range um for that same price and of course that gives so much moisture so much kind of zing so much more vibrancy about your skin you can tell which brand i love can't you was brought up with Okay, so on that note, thank you very much for watching this, and yeah, Dragon's Blood. Make it, make from it what you wish, I suppose you could say. Um, for me, it's 
it's a no, but I'm glad I've tried the product. I'm glad that I've reviewed the product. It's a different product, Dragon's Blood Instant Lifting Serum. Yes, it certainly lifts and tightens, but you have to pay for that as well. Okay, so thank you very much indeed for sharing this clip with me. Until next time, take great care. Thanks very much for being here, and I'll be seeing you real soon. Bye for now.